uh, that goes beyond even the issues that he is raising uh, on bringing up a policy. Mr. Speaker, the Honorable Mwenje is a member of parliament in a Nairobi constituency. And so am I. But the history of land in this city is scary. To imagine that there are squatters in Nairobi in a place that has been uh, a, 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 a city with a, with a history replete of disinheriting of people. That the people who we call squatters in the Goretti South constituency today were actual owners of the land where they are being called squatters today. In fact, in the city, they are not called squatters. They are called people living in a place called parking. I never get to understand how these places are called parking. That you are parked in an area by the colonialists so that you can be unpacked whenever they wish to unpack you. Mr. Speaker, we cannot discuss about land issues or bring about new policies without revisiting history. Mr. Speaker, why we have such big problems with land in this country is because of the colonial policy hang-ups that we suffer from. Mr. Speaker, the Land Ordinance Act of 1902, the Land Ordinance Act of 1915, the very founding documents of disinheriting people in, of their lands in Kenya are the ones that inform the historical injustices that we suffer to, till today. So, Mr. Speaker, I take this opportunity to first commend the Honorable Member, who is a very uh, ranking uh, legal uh, practitioner, because by bringing this motion, he pierces our conscience to start relooking at our land policies wholesome. What has been happening, Mr. Speaker, is that when, every, when a matter on land comes up, we make a small law at some small corner about that small problem trying to resolve a small mischief, never once wanting to attend to the broader issues that are affecting land that are bigger than the two small uh, laws that we make in the small corners, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I would want to encourage the Honorable Mwenje to take up this matter, craft it into a bill, so that now we start attending to the issues, not only of historical injustices, not only of the small uh, issue of squatters, not only of the small uh, uh, thuggery that is happening, not small, the big thuggery that is happening in lands offices across the country, so that we once and for all address the land issues in this country holistically, Mr. Speaker. The issue of titling in this country is a big matter. Today, Mwenje, who is the mover, as a lawyer will tell you that he is not even in a position as a legal practitioner to verify what a proper title is. Today, you could be holding a legal title, thinking that you own land, only to find that there are photocopies or copies of other titles that are claiming to be legal on the same piece of land that you are claiming, Mr. Speaker. So, Mr. Speaker, I would want to accord more time to more members because I know there is more interest. I would not want to add more than that than to encourage Mwenje to make it into a bill so that we can address the issue, address the issue of land more holistically rather than the small cocoons of uh, legislation that we have been trying to do to attend to land issues. Mr. Speaker, let me spare some time for some other members. Thank you very much. This seems to be an Arobi... <laughs> MP's issue. I'll give this chance to the member for Starehe.